good morning students okay so in the last video we got a lot of information about the half of the question paper so in this video uh, we are going to start uh, from the question number 26 okay so that is from the passive voice form okay and then fifth main question number 26 okay so here i'm going to answer okay so just only i'm going to uh, tell the answers okay for the first one tapo one dash if you want uh, the grammar video so i will upload later okay so one by one okay yes now all of you get the answer only so for the first one here right so there is only one word so that's where we we'll take auxiliary verb help of the b form auxiliary verb so and also we want to observe the subject subject is singular tapo one so that's why and also we want to observe so 90 percent paragraph paragraphs are in past tense in your textbook okay ninth lesson and then the fourth lesson everything i need to know i learn in the forest i believe that books will never disappear both just lesson okay so they only want to observe present tense and also want to observe some lines okay but here we want to observe especially the two lessons so tapo one so this is from everything i need to know i learned in the forest tapo one okay so here was written by ravindra tatagur so answer is was written and then so i want to leave all those things because of this is in the past tense so that's why and then according to him the culture culture of the forest dash again here culture of the forest so there is culture of the forest so that is was influenced by so what, what is the answer here was influenced and then the diverse process of renewal of life the forest dash but here this is not the passive form okay so here i'm going to write symbol symbolize symbolizes so that is the answer of the uh, pu board okay but here we are going to expect the lecturers are going to um, teach the students so that is the passive form not the active form okay so that's why i want to write here so that is uh, was symbolized that is wrong but here the symbolizers is the correct according to the key answer okay so i will come to the so the next question number 27 so that is the reported speech so that is the report the following conversation so here you want to observe all the lines so this is also very very easiest one if you know the rules how to write the correct answers okay for each and everything so you want to observe the four pillars the first one pronoun the second one adverbs the third one tense it means the auxiliary verbs and then another one <coughs> so here the it means uh, the first one pronoun so another one is the last one questions it means uh, we are on to observe the two, two two types of questions the one is Yes, a lot of question another one is wh questions and also want to observe some words so that is the imperative sentences command request okay order okay so like this so but here we want to observe the different sentences so we want to observe the two yes, a lot of questions and then one it means that two again two wh questions another one the last line is there okay so that is the assertive sentence so here just i want to uh, tell the answer so Dona Laura, okay. So Dona Laura asked Don Gonzalo if there is a sonnet of question, we want to use if or whether. So that's why I'm going to use if or whether. Again, here we want to interchange the pronoun and the auxiliary verb. And then we want to add that auxiliary verb with the main verb. Do plus use use if there is the present tense. If you want, you'll watch my video. Okay, so that is the reported speech. Okay. Yes. I will upload as soon as possible. So that is the uh, video of the passive voice and then video of the so I will give some key points okay so it means the shortcuts for that passive voice and then reported speech okay Dona Laura so just I am going to uh, tell the answer the first line so Dona Laura asked Don Gonzalo if or whether he could use his handkerchief as a shoe brush so this is the answer for the first one so just you are going to remove that uh, colon and then pull question mark just put the pull stop and then you'll move to the second line don gonzalo replied why not look at there don gonzalo replied whom don alora why not it means if there is wh question we want to use as a proposition so the same wh word but in the sonnet of question we want to use if for whether if there is imperative sentence we want to use to if there is answer assertive sentence we want to use that 
okay so like that one to use and then why not it means the answer don gonzalo replied why not use it why not use it this is also correct but and also we want to use this one so this is also correct because of the so the answer is here he used his handkerchief as a shoe brush so the reply here why not so that's why i want to use why could not he use could not he use it so that is also correct okay why he could not use it okay and then i will move to the third one do you use a shoe brush as a handkerchief again here we want to use the if for whether because of yes or not of question is here how we want to identify yes or not of question we will watch the video okay yes and then laura further questioned or laura asked if for whether okay laura asked don gonzalo if for whether he used shoe brush as a handkerchief okay he used <coughs> shoe brush as a handkerchief again don gonzalo what right have you criticized my action so this is wh question so that's why i want to use the same wh word here okay so don gonzalo <coughs> asked look at that don gonzalo questioned her asked her asked uh, dona laura what right she had again here also i want to interchange have and you auxiliary verb and pronoun she had to criticize have to look at there have is changed to had okay present perfect tense change into past perfect tense in present tense change into past tense so that's why <coughs> she had to criticize his action so observe this one to is there criticize is there so why we are not going to change this one criticize into criticize it like use into use it okay so because of here to criticize so that is called the infinitive so that's why the infinitive are not going to change okay so my action is going to change is <coughs> his action and then dona laura so the last line so here laura replied that this is assertive sentence that's why i want to use that look at that a neighbor's right what is a neighbor's right so that is it was a neighbor's right we are going to use in the past tense okay it was a neighbor's right okay have understood this one as yes, i will come to the question number 28 so look at this one okay so just i am going to read the answers salesman so question number 28 conversation between the customer and seller so one is customer another one is the seller seller is the salesman customer is the reka so that's why good morning madam greeting and then reka she is going to ask it means inquiring okay i am looking for a good television i am looking for a good shoes like that good shoe like that she is going to inquiry okay so not only television mobile like this book like that salesman are you looking for any particular brand it means the salesman is going to give the information okay so which one is good it means you are going to searching the particular brand like that so here reka giving preferences she is going to give the preference okay i am looking for a sony or samsung it means she is going to give the preference here okay she because of she is going to buy televisions and then salesman these brands these brands are very popular madam reka is yes, here there is in bracket selecting if you don't know how to write the answer just all of remember the match the following in the first year puc okay so one is function one side is expressions another one side is functions okay so we'll refer that one okay so definitely will get good marks i understood as yes. and then reka so here she is going to selecting i prefer samsung or i prefer puma shoe i prefer samsung like this she is going to give the answer to the salesman certainly madam so definitely will select that one so reka thank you look at there thanks giving leave taking that's all leave taking means bye 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 see you okay so like that okay and then thanks giving means there is a word thanks if you write thanks definitely will get mark one mark so this is the easiest part i already told you okay so reka thank you bye so that is enough okay i will come to the question number 29 so this is from the japan and brazil through a traveler's eye was written by george mikes and then here the number of motor vehicles in brazil is growing by look at there what is the answer so what is in your textbook so they don't select the same word same passage for you okay so this is the ready food for you just you want to remove which is the wrong okay which is not in that paragraph definitely will write the correct answers 
idioms and phrases expressions for this question okay so here which is not um, correct suitable to this paragraph so that is the fair game so that is wrong one here it means the for the first one so that is the leaps and bounds okay and then almost as if cars were distributed free of charge to all and sundry okay so this is the second one for the first one leaps and bounds second one all and sundry okay have understood this one yes okay so and then here the question number 30 here also don't write the whole paragraph or one by one okay so don't give the sub question numbers for this okay so here the fill in the blanks with the right i already told you answer but here the for the first one so that is uh, when because of here here is there dash before the dash which word is there okay if there is a it is going to refer to the it means uh, because of this is called the linkers look at that linker means conjunction okay so we want to use the suitable conjunction okay in this paragraph for the first one when for the second one own husband is there husband okay so that's why who had obtained okay so advani advani in 1977 when a village man named Bachni Devi led resistance against her own husband who had obtained a contract to cut trees. Her involvement in ecology, look at that, her involvement in ecology with Chipko movement, with Chipko, okay, so that is in the Himalayan region, okay, with Chipko that was taking place in the Himalayan region. Some of you write the answer for the, for, it means uh, the question, so I think uh, question number. Yes, uh, the question number what is the question number so uh, <clears throat> I think uh, question number it's okay leave it okay so where uh, where question number four so here all of you write uh, Himalayan region but the, but the perfect answer is uh, so that is in Dune Valley okay have understood yes I will come to the question number 31st it means uh, sixth may question number 31 okay so here the hospital so here all of you observe this is very 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 easiest one because uh, they are going to give clues for you and also question numbers uh, beside that question numbers or above that question number or after that question number okay or inside that box sometimes i want to give answer okay so there is no problem but here you have to observe the clues it means the keywords and then you don't write the answer okay so here the hospital as we see today began to evolve only around 19th century look at that began where is began began to evolve only around 19th century began to start i that's all okay so that is 19th century for the first one 19th century the second one live in so here the live in so observe that one so live in means here so that is uh, People began to live in better conditions. Look at that. After the live in, what is the word there? Better conditions. So that is the answer for the second one. And then people felt. Okay, people felt. Observe this one. They felt. So here they refers to people. So that's why people people felt. Okay. So the need for more cleanliness. So here the answer for the third one. So that is the need for more cleanliness. And look at there there is no and but they are going to give the fourth one so that is good <coughs> good expert care so here the fourth one good expert care and the fifth one in the past look at there in the past so there are three boxes fifth one sixth one seventh one we want to observe the three answers nuns priests other members of the church though these three are the answer for that one okay so here nuns priest and other members of the church had done the nursing it means the answer answer is uh, <clears throat> the nuns priests and other members yes and then the last one first hospital and then had done nursing like this so here they, they are all the keywords but here the first hospital was saint thomas it means first hospital which is the first hospital here so that is uh, hospital was saint Thomas Hospital by Florence Nightingale. Some have read Florence Nightingale. So that is the name. But here Thomas Hospital, that is the <coughs> St. Thomas Hospital, that is the hospital name, first hospital. Okay. Yes. And then letter writing. Some of you don't know how to write a letter. 
because of there is no format if you write the write in, write in a correct format so definitely you will get at least two marks in a right format and then if there is correct uh, body of the letter or all the words uh, comma and then colon everything okay if there is and also we're on top of the reverse okay so there is we are not going to use a first of it the reverse faithfully or reverse sincerely like that if you if there is a uh, in a correct format you will get two marks okay and also we are on to observe another another one thing mm. <clears throat> so for the body of the letter okay three marks and then for the format two marks if there is if both are correct definitely you will get four and four and a half and five if there is no spelling mistake okay so all of you watch my video okay how to write a letter okay in a simple way yes so here they are going to give the address right xxx for name and then yy for address but you don't know so half of answer is here in this question look at there write a letter of application in response to the following advertisement which appeared in times of india dated 23rd march 2020 look at that 23rd march is there that is not problem what is the date you are going to write the same date so the first step is from but don't write from okay that is understood the first one is from you don't write xxx and yyy and then the second one you have to write date so just write date 20 23rd march 2020 that's all okay so asta na baradre saaku nee en martire nenu baritra date so that is also understood okay and then you have to write the two address where is two address in your question paper observe that one okay so apply to the public relations officer inter technologies private limited 567 sai towers chamrajpete bangalore so that's all so this is the two address after the two address you have to write the salutation salutation means dear sir or respected sir like this or respected madam or sir or madam after that one put a comma so that is important don't forget it okay and then subject what is the subject application for the post of which post junior assistant that's all okay application for the post of junior assistant okay and then after that one reference where did you refer this um, information okay i referred okay or i got observe this one okay <clears throat> i referred uh, for the post i referred this advertisement in times of india dated 23rd march 2020 that's all is to further sakar reference can then you want to start body of the letter with reference of above subject what is the subject so just you want to write uh, letter okay so just you want to use the some words if you want to want to add all those things it means all the resumes bio data with uh, <clears throat> with <clears throat> with the body of the letter in body of the letter or you are going to write in a separate page okay so after the body of the letter you have to write thank you don't write thanks you thanking you okay just you have to write thank you all are in left side okay block style so that's why and then after the thank you you have to write yours faithfully okay yours faithfully or yours sincerely like this okay yes and then this is subscription okay yes and then the last one signature you have to put the signature what is the name so there is a uh, <coughs> what uh, relation what is the name you have to write put the signature the same thing okay so like that so here you have to write you was faithfully and then xxx that's all if you want you are going to write in the bracket again you are going to put the signature no problem okay so, yes and then you'll move to the resume okay so all of you know how to write a resume name date of birth and then father name okay so and then qualification and then skills experience okay and then if you got the experience you have going to write the reference there also where did you work okay as a junior assistant like this you don't write a letter okay and then i'll move to question number 33 i think uh, this video is not short so please all of you watch this video okay so i think this is the important video for you as the question number 33 and also all of you subscribe okay don't forget it imagine you are the secretary of the college union a function has been organized to mark library week so it means you are going to observe the library week it means uh, celebrating a library week so that's why you have be you have to speak you have to speak sorry for the inconvenience okay 
So in the year, you have to speak on the importance of the books. Use the following points and write a speech about 100 words. So look at that. Okay, so here you are going to observe this one. So all the words, what is below that question? Okay, so here just you are going to follow the first one, wishing. How to wish? Greeting. So that is good morning everyone. Good morning respected principal, lecturers and then chief guests and audience those who are there okay those who are going to listen your speech so here you are going to wish them okay so that is important okay so if you wish like that definitely will get one mark okay if there is in a good way of writing okay so this is called here the speech preparation and then you are going to use all those things it means all the words what about the books and then you're going to write uh, some paragraph it means uh, not paragraph a paragraph okay so that is words hundred words at last okay if you write thank you one and all okay thank you all those who are there okay if you are going to say thanks so definitely you will get one more for this one okay so this is the starting and closing and then in the middle of if you get two totally one plus one plus two four if you write in a correct way and then so observe this one so in the spirit preparation greeting collect long it means correct wrong long ways and then cohesion and then leave taking so that is thank you how you are going to end that uh, speech so that is also important okay so like that you are going to uh, write this speech okay understood ah if you don't know how to write this one you will come to the report writing okay so this is b you don't write b and then report writing so here you don't write the report to the editor just don't write to and then the editor okay so here the pie chart given below certainly represents to income and expenditure of the expenditure of a urban family in a metropolitan city metropolitan city based on the information write a report about 120 words but here look at this one here just only 100 words okay speech preparation so this is the easiest one when we are going to compare to this one because of here uh, we want to observe all those things what is in the <coughs> what is here information okay in this pie chart okay so and also we want to observe graph all those things okay so <coughs> that's why so and to observe all those things then we want to write here so how we are going to write this one to the editor presentation of data what is the data is there you want to present all those things food and clothing 40 percent okay so you are going to take a higher to lower or lower to higher like this okay so you want to presentation of data and then analysis analysis and really visualization in a mod okay aki gai ki eni gai ki iri iri te compare na mod beko compare and contrast and the karate okay other na mod beko and then the next questions it means your language expressions is very very important here to get mark if there is a spelling mistake or language expression is wrong we are going to cut one mark or two mark or half mark like this okay so this is also easiest part to get the mark okay so that is a speech preparation because of there is wishing and then closing so that is a greeting and then leave taking if you write those two and then if there is cohesion is correct it means the link correct link and then correct language is there definitely will get four okay yes i will come to the last uh, question number 34 in the seventh main so this is pronoun all of you know pronoun instead of noun we want to use pronoun that's all so just all of you keep in your mind so just but here the one mistake it means so that is so every time it means in all the question papers we want to observe so they want to select this short paragraph from the passage but this year they are not going to select that one from the passage so observe this one when at sang came to india to learn about people who here they don't underline look at there what do the underlined words in the following extract refer to they are going to extract it means a select extract means select okay so this paragraph so here so that pronoun are going to refer underlying words are going to refer to whom or to who okay yarna refer madute antakantanalli helta hota which place like this okay so here the they are going to underline the for the first one so that is who so who means here so i already told you okay so that is here i will come to here okay so question number 30 own husband so what is the answer here who before the dash we want to observe own husband okay so there is name person so that's why here who if there is who we are going to write so who not song no and then here 
came to India to learn about about after the people we are going to observe who so that's why before the who we are going to observe people so that's why we are going to write the perfect answer people okay yes or indians look at there india learn about people so totally indians so both are answer here correct and then who lived here look at there here where venat song came to india so this is historical paragraph okay so venat song ವಿಜಯನಗರ ಸಾಮ್ರಾಜ್ಯಕ್ಕೆ ಬರ್ತಾನೆ ಸೊ ಆ ಒಂದು ಸಂದರ್ಭವನ್ನು ಕೊಟ್ಟಿರ್ತಕ್ಕಂಥದ್ದು ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಹೂ ಲೀವ್ ಇಯರ್ ಸಾರಿ ಲೀವ್ಡ್ ಇಯರ್ ಇಯರ್ ಫಸ್ಟು ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ದ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಒನ್ ಈ ಕೇಮ್ ವಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಥ್ರೂ ದ ಮೌಂಟೈನ್ಸ್ ಫೇಸಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಹಿ ವಾಸ್ ಲುಕ್ ಅಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೇಸಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಗೋನ್ ಟು ಫೇಸ್ ಲಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಕಮ್ ಇಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಕೇಮ್ ಟು ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ಇಂಡಿಯಾಗೆ ಬರ್ಬೇಕಾದ್ರೆ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಸಾಕಷ್ಟು ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ನ ಎರಿಸ್ತಾನೆ ಯಾರು ಎದುರಿಸೋದು ಯಾರು ಬರ್ತಾನೆ ವಿನತ್ ಸಾಂಗ್ ಬರ್ತಾನೆ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಇಯರ್ ಇಯರ್ ಫಸ್ಟು ವಿನತ್ ಸಾಂಗ್ ವಾಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಡ್ರೆಸ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ಎ ಸ್ಟ್ರೇಂಜ್ ಅಟ್ಟೈಲ್ ಲುಕ್ ಅಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಡ್ರೆಸ್ಡ್ ಇನ್ ಎ ಸ್ಟ್ರೇಂಜ್ ಅಟ್ಟೈಲ್ ಇಯರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಟ್ಟೆ ಸ್ಟ್ರೇಂಜ್ ಅಂದರೆ ವಿಚಿತ್ರವಾಗಿರ್ತಕ್ಕಂಥದ್ದು ಅಟ್ಟೈರ್ ಅಂದರೆ ವಿಚಿತ್ರವಾಗಿರ್ತಕ್ಕಂಥ ಒಂದು ಉಡುಪನ್ನು ಅವನು ಧರಿಸಿರ್ತಾನೆ ಅಟ್ಟೈರ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅಮ್ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಓಕೆ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಅರೌಂಡ್ ಈಮ್ ಅವ್ನು ಸುತ್ತಮುತ್ತಲು ಇರ್ತಕ್ಕಂಥ ಜನಗಳಿಗೆ ಏನಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಒಂದು ರೀತಿ ಆಶ್ಚರ್ಯ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಅಯ್ಯೋ ಏನಪ್ಪ ಹಿಂಗಿದ್ದಾನೆ ಆಗಿದ್ದಾನೆ ಅಂತಕ್ಕಂಥದ್ದಲ್ಲಿ ನೋಡ್ತಾ ಹೋಗ್ತಾರೆ ಓಕೆ ಎಸ್ ಸೊ ಇಯರ್ ದ ದಿಸ್ ರೆಫರ್ಸ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟ್ರೇಂಜ್ ಅಟ್ಟೈರ್ ಎ ಸ್ಟ್ರೇಂಜ್ ಅಟ್ಟೈರ್ ಆಫ್ ಯುನ್ ಎಸ್ ಸಾಂಗ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವೈ ದಿಸ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಸ್ಟ್ರೇಂಜ್ ಅಟ್ಟೈರ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಒನ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಕಮ್ ಟು ದಿ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ದಟ್ ಒನ್ ಆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಯು ಸಬ್ಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ ದಿಸ್ video don't forget because of i am going to uploading a lot of video about uh, education about uh, especially puc okay so i'm going to solve more question papers for you and also for supplementary students okay so those who want to write the supplementary exam so that is especially english so all i am going to give some clues for you okay so all of you watch uh, my videos okay so the question number 35 rearrange the jumbled segments to form a meaningful sentence so look at there so here they want to give that if uh, words so here the answer is the first one every and then country as its own language every country has its own language okay yes i think um, i solved all the grammar parts and then one more questions okay so if there is possible okay so just i will show the key answer for this one okay so all of you know see this one look at there all of you pause this uh, video and then observe the answer for the four marks so this is the key scheme of evaluation okay yes and then uh, so observe this one all of you pause and then observe the answers okay yes welcome to another one the last part it's yes, okay so all of you bye see you in the next video don't forget to subscribe